Today, very warm welcome. Uh, we have a very good friend, uh, our partner, very loyal partner. Okay, we are invited for today. Uh, actually, you can see Alan is here. Okay, so uh, uh, let me introduce Alan. Alan actually is our uh, sub distributor uh, in Philippines. Okay, and Alan is the owner for the company. The company is called Which Hope. Okay, uh, actually, I know Alan for a long time. Okay. Uh, uh, we work for many projects, uh, enterprise projects in Philippines. Okay, so today uh, I am uh, very happy to invite Alan okay, to our speech because Alan have prepared a very good story uh, how using the cloud to doing the, the, the enterprise project. Okay, so maybe before we moving on, I know uh, not, not all of you well known about Alan and which hope. Okay, so maybe uh, uh, I give Alan some time. Okay, uh, Alan, hi, how are you? <laughs> nice how to meet you? you. Yes, yes. Okay, so uh, can you uh, tell us a bit audience uh, interest, okay? Uh, who are, who are we, which hope and uh, about yourself, okay? Can you briefly tell us about your company uh, and about you? <laughs> okay. okay, all right. Uh, thank you, William, for uh, for that uh, nice introduction. I'm Alan, uh, the uh, general manager for uh, Rich Hope Technologies. Uh, our company started way back 2013. Uh, we started very small. Uh, we started very humble, uh, doing uh, simple uh, uh, computer technical services, simple technical support. Uh, during that time, the local area network is not very known. Uh, uh, simple uh, network solutions is enough. Now, as we go on, as the company progresses, we uh, was able to uh, support uh, uh, medium enterprises, uh, offices, uh, healthcare facilities, uh, warehouses, and uh, sometimes uh, uh, energy companies. Now, uh, during those times, 2013, uh, I don't know Ruje yet. Okay, okay. We are trying to make use of uh, any brands we can uh, get, or, uh, whatever brand we get is available during that time. But as uh, we progresses, as our company grows, the clientele also grows, okay? So they are looking for a good solution. They are looking for best network solutions. So I keep on uh, searching in order to support these uh, requirements by our clients. Then, now I'm just thinking why the, there's always complaints on the network where in fact we are trying our best to to, uh, to alleviate the problem by changing the cables, uh, changing uh, switches from time to time, okay? So it's a puzzle to us. It's a big puzzle to us. Why there's always a network problem? There's always disconnection. There's always, uh, uh, how do you call Downtime, okay? Downtime. So for two years, you need to change again, again, and again. So this is a head, headache. Now, uh, then uh, when I when I decided to then I decided to uh, outsource, try to outsource a different brand. Then uh, there's a time when I visited China at uh, at Guangzhou. Okay. Uh, I saw this airport, a beautiful airport, this Bayon, Bayon Airport. Mm. Okay, it's, it's a high-tech, high, high uh, state-of-the-art uh, airport. Okay, there's a good Wi-Fi access for everybody. I, I, I keep on thinking, why where, wherever I go in the airport, there's a good Wi-Fi access. So, I thought to myself, what kind, what brand is being used here? Well, then I look at the ceiling. Then I saw this brand, 
before I can see because the dog is small, so I just try to zoom the camera and was able to capture the brand. Uh, even don't know how, how to pronounce, right? Oh, it's it's Ruji. Uh, uh, I mentioned I mentioned it as Ruigi, uh, Ruigi, but yeah. uh, I, I just learned that the right pro, uh, pronunciation is Ruji. Yes, correct. Uh, correct. Okay, <laughs> brand is this. I don't know this brand. Uh, why? Why this brand is seamless? Where, wherever you go, there's there's uh, continuous wireless access. Then I search in uh, I searched uh, I searched the name the UJ. Then I found Roy. Roy is uh, he's a sales engineer with UJ, and Roy is very uh, accommodating. Uh, when I ask him. Where do you, where do you, where is the deployment of this brand? Is this a new brand? I don't know this brand. Then uh, I ask him if he can take me to places in China. Okay, he took me to the subway, and I'm amazed. There's internet. There's wireless access in the subway. Again, I saw the the Ruji access point anywhere. Oh, it's really amazing that uh, wherever you go, there's a good Wi-Fi access and RUJ is being used everywhere. Uh, now, now uh, in three days' time of uh, exploring the areas with RUJ, I decided to uh, set a meeting with Roy uh, in one of RUJ offices. Then... Uh, uh, introduced to him my requirements. So he was able to find a solution for that. So, uh, to conclude, we, uh, which of, how, how long which hope is uh, working with UJ already? With CMC? Uh, with UJ. Uh, you. you. Oh, Ruji, Ruji. Yeah. Uh, I've been working with Ruji for five years. Five years already. Okay. Five years already. So, so, so far, uh, how, how many your customer uh, or how many UAJ devices is uh, serving your customer? Uh, uh, in terms of APs, I already sold uh, 100, 100 uh, APs to different uh, clients. It's okay. not just CMC. Huh? Uh, yeah. We also serve to hotels mm. and boutique hotels, offices. So there are about hundreds of deployment of APs. I see. Uh, for switches, uh, uh, about 100 uh, switches already has been uh, deployed to different clients. I see, I see. And uh, so far, very good. Feedback very good, right? Ah, mm. Very good, yeah. There is okay. no RMA yet. Uh, mm. For five years, there is no RMA. So when there is no RMA, it means that's a big savings for us. Okay, so can you tell us about more about the CMC? Ah. CMC okay. in Philippines? About CMC? Yeah. yeah. Mm. All right. Uh, CMC uh, uh, is uh, my best, uh, CMC is my biggest client so far. CMC, Kalamba Medical Center is uh, uh, my biggest client so far. Now, who is CMC or who is Kalamba Medical Center? Kalamba Medical Center is uh, famous and or known uh, in the southern uh, part of the Philippines. Okay, so they have uh, state-of-the-art facilities that supports different uh, healthcare needs by uh, uh, by by uh, how do you call this supporting the area, the Laguna area primarily. So uh, they have the cancer center, they have the dialysis center, uh, they have the medical arts building, uh, uh, they have the complete line of uh, healthcare equipment. Okay, uh, it is a 122 bed tertiary hospital and uh, still growing. It's fully equipped with uh, 
uh, treatment facility uh, serving about 10,000 uh, patients uh, annually. Uh, so the requirement for uh, network, good network uh, facility is really needed. So Kalimba Medical Center is uh, known and uh, it's a good hospital. Okay, so mm -hmm. it is comparative to uh, big hospitals in Manila. So, so uh, how how is the Wi-Fi so critical? Okay, so the Wi-Fi uh, is using for gas, or you uh, the Wi-Fi is for the uh, CMC employee use. Hmm. The Wi-Fi. Okay, so. Uh, healthcare professionals, especially at Calamba Medical Center. Uh, Wi-Fi access is really of importance because they need to transfer from one facility to another. They don't want to have a disconnection because sometimes they are, while walking, they need to access the medical records because they are in a hurry. Uh, so, so, uh, seamless Wi-Fi is very important. So you uh, mean it's the being used by healthcare professionals and officers of the hospital. Okay. So you mean the professional, uh, the, the, the doctors, the nurse, they are using some smartphone, smart tablet uh, to assess the patient record, right? Uh, anywhere. Yes. Okay. So that's why uh, the Wi-Fi is critical because uh, if the Wi-Fi not stable, not fast enough, Doctor, nursery, the professional cannot assess the client or patient yes. record. Okay, instantly. Okay. Wi-Fi is very critical because mm. if a doctor wants to see an X-ray image images, mm. sometimes if the uh, sometimes it's slow, you know, mm. uh, because the image must be a high definition image. If the Wi-Fi is not good the loading will, uh, will, uh, will be a problem. So mm. it's, important, it's very important they, that the Wi-Fi access is fast and stable. Mm. Okay, okay. So I, I, I believe uh, Wi-Fi uh, do, do a lot of help uh, for CMC, our UJ Wi-Fi. Okay. How about the capacity? You also mentioned some capacity issue mm, before okay. for the Wi-Fi. The, the capacity of each AP uh, with other brands, okay? I've used different brands before. Sometimes uh, only 10 users can connect. More than 10 users, it's already a problem. Some will be disconnected. Some cannot connect, uh, all those problems, uh, okay? While uh, AP of uh, Ruge can support more than 100 users per AP, per AP, one AP can support hundreds of users. Mm -hmm. So if there are Ruge AP on different places of a building, they work hand in hand in order to experience a maximum Wi-Fi uh, so, uh, wi access. Okay, okay. And you also mentioned uh, the security for the Wi-Fi. Uh, okay, because the, the, your old, old brand is uh, uh, using PSK. Uh, okay, uh, the password, Wi-Fi password will be EC shared. Ah, to the others, okay. So, so what happened if uh, uh, there's some 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 officer or some staff share the Wi-Fi password to the outsider? What what is the impact to CMC if it it happened? If someone share the Wi-Fi password to others? Okay, if if an employee uh, shares the password, there will be a big impact on the security of the hospital. Mm. Uh, as we all know, medical records are very confidential. Mm. So it must not be uh, seen by any unauthorized uh, mm. 
people. So, the pressured key is very dangerous actually. Mm. It's very dangerous because once an employee have an access, he will share it to anybody. Mm. So, that anybody you know, will have an access to hospital uh, mm. uh, network and uh, he, maybe he can find a way to to intrude and uh, meddle with the hospital network. It's very dangerous. Yes, yes, yes. yes. So then, then uh, can you summary what, how, how PPSK can help CMC now? Hmm. Okay, uh, PPSK is a big help to uh, CMC. Uh, as I mentioned or as I keep on saying, PPSK is a unique feature uh, that gives a unique unique uh, password for each devices. Mm. So if the password is unique, it's secure mm. because it cannot be used by any other uh, user or device anymore. Mm. So it's very secure. I see. In the past, the PPSK in the past, okay? Uh, uh, I believe uh, you also share with me, there are some operation or management limitation, okay? And uh, recently, we also released a new uh, beta version called PPSK Lite, okay? Uh, uh, Alan, can you also share uh, what, what is our uh, uh, old and new PPSK, okay? Uh, the benefit can, uh, or the changes bring to you, Alan? The old, old and, and new the, PPSK. Uh, old and new PPSK, yes. Uh, okay. Uh, the old PPSK do not have this feature. So in order to create a new PPSK uh, account, uh, the, the uh, admin or the IT staff must go inside the configuration, which... Uh, which will uh, put the entire configuration at risk. Okay, mm -hmm. so by having this new feature, the copy, uh, the uh, share PPSK, okay, it can be shared uh, by a link uh, and can be sent uh, on Messenger or on WeChat. So the IT staff can easily show the status or see the status of the uh, PPSK users, then from there they can add. So this feature is new and uh, it's good for uh, securing the, uh, the network configuration. Mm. Ellen, can you, would you mind share us how, how to do, huh, when if you have a new customer now, how you do the sharing to, uh, about okay. the PPSK? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Click this. It's very easy. Then you can send it. Uh, I'll just use a notepad, perhaps. Uh, you can uh, paste it like that, or you can put it on the browser. Okay, so that's it. Okay. Then you can add from here. Okay, add the account. Maybe I will add, maybe I'll add again. Another name, let's say William again. <laughs> okay, thank you. William too. Okay. Okay. Operation succeeded. Succeeded. Okay. So this is a secure function because hmm. there's no need to go inside or to log in to the uh, web application. Mm. So you can do this using your mobile phone. Mm. You, can use, you can do this using your tablet. You can do this using uh, any browser. Yes. Okay. So this is secure. So see, you cannot edit, you mm. cannot change, or you cannot alter any of this. Mm. But you can add. Mm. So this screen only share to your, uh, your, your customer, right? To your enterprise uh, office customer, huh. okay. Yes, just, just share this. We just yeah. share this. 
Okay. So now they, 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 you, you know more because uh, OPPSK, you need to create a uh, account, employee account for them. And this is dangerous, right? And complex. Very complex. Uh, on the old PPSK, you need to go inside uh, yes. the mm. configuration tool, mm. which is very dangerous because they may change or they may delete some configurations that are very important. Yes. So yes. this will be a very big problem for us. Yeah. So with this, so the the entire configuration is safe. Mm. So there's no threats. See, uh, you don't have to worry that a uh, new user will change in the yes. make everything uh, worse. So this one is really good. Okay. Uh, so so thank you for your our experience, uh, pilot user experience uh, for the new PPSK. Okay. Thank you, William. Uh, may I know more about CMC? Okay, uh, not just uh, Wi-Fi. Okay, uh, because um, uh, I I know there are some uh, medical equipment. They are also rely on a very fast and stable backbone. Because stable Wi-Fi also rely on a stable network backbone, right? Okay. So before I I know. Uh, Alan is uh, introduced in another brand, uh, letter H, okay? Uh, but, but maybe uh, also some uh, staple issue, right? The, the old backbone, okay? About the CMC. Okay. Uh, CMC is a big, uh, I would say, it's already a big hospital. So they have a complete line of uh, healthcare equipment, uh, like the CT scan, MRI, we also have, they also have the linear accelerator machine, okay? All this uh, medical equipment uh, must be connected to the network in order to transmit the images, uh, 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 the images uh, which is a result of the, uh, how they call this, uh, interpretation of the machine. So it will be transmitted to the network. There are hundreds of images being uh, transmitted over the network uh, uh, on a daily basis. So as we all know, if the image is uh, of high definition, it will require a uh, uh, fast network. Mm. Okay. So Ruji, uh supports this uh, requirement because the images can be transported quickly and uh, save, be saved to the server or the central da database of the hospital. Mm -hmm. Sometimes uh, there are also uh, videos, okay? medical uh, impression videos being transported over the network. Uh, they are big files. so. If the network is slow, then it will be a problem because you can no longer send the, uh, the impression on a timely manner. Uh, what, what, what is the backbone now using? Backbone. backbone. Yeah, backbone. Yeah. Okay, we use S5750 as the core switch and uh, using a fiber backbone with 10G. SFP. So this is enough. It's very fast already. Uh, we connected these buildings using S5750C uh, switch with 10G. Mm. Uh, the network is fast. So all buildings are connected uh, uh, in a very fast manner. Mm, okay. So now the, all the medical equipment can access to the medical database very fast. Yes. Mm. Okay. Good. 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 And also, okay. also, uh, this uh, HIS Hospital Information System, mm. uh, which is uh, the core software uh, for mm. hospital operations, especially yes. on generating the revenues. Yes. Okay. Uh, the Hospital Information System uh, must be. Uh, uh, process quickly, okay, because it, it accesses the database uh, 
uh, every time. So if the network is slow, so the billing will be slow also. So <laughs> it's important that there's a good and uh, mm. fast and stable network. Mm. Yeah. So, so how, how, how many switches in, in the project? Uh, how many switches uh, deployed? We have about 35 uh, distribution uh, switches, uh, if I may uh, remember. Uh, uh, about 35... Uh, 29 series. Yeah. 29, 10 series distribution yeah. switches. These are managed, managed switches. And uh, then about... Yeah. There are, uh, for for Wi-Fi, we use twenty nine ten PoE PoE switches. That's about uh, I think twenty or more than that. I, I can't recall because there are so many deployments already. Mm. And about five uh, S fifty seven fifty switches with ten G uh, SFP. Uh, we also installed the uh, RG wall. 1600 and uh, we also have the RSR30 router uh, which supports uh, I think 2000, 2000 users it's, yes. it's it's more than enough so yes. uh, plus uh, plus the 57 core switches uh, yeah yeah mm, okay okay so the then, uh, the solution use, total solution you uh, XS mm. XS nineteen twenty switch okay. for uh, for the uh, data center. Uh, it serves as the redundant switch, hmm. so that is to ensure that there will be no uh, uh, how they call this uh, downtime. So we can we configure we configured the switch in or in order to uh, to make it uh, redundant. Hmm. So this is uh, total. Total UEJ solution. There's no problem. Yeah. It's more. It's almost. Yeah. It's almost for uh, four years. More than three years already. There's no problem. Mm -hmm. So so total UEJ solution, uh, right? From switches, Wi-Fi, uh, uh, firewall gateways, routers, all UEJ. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. And uh, all managed uh, by UEJ Cloud now, right? Right. Right. Okay. Okay. Ah, and and you, but, you also uh, mentioned very one hundred percent now because mm. because now uh, be, uh, when we started uh, deploying RuJ, uh, uh, the cloud is new. The, the cloud is new during that time, mm. uh, so we are using this uh, SMP software, mm. SMP, SNC, and uh, slowly. We are migrating to cloud, mm. but the Wi-Fi are already 100% migrated to cloud. Okay. Before it's connected to SMP SNC. software. SNC, SNC, SNC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. SNC. So SNC, SNC. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Good. Very good, good. And and Alan, you also mentioned about the support. Okay. So far, nearly four years. Uh, no, no, any hardware RMA or no any uh, uh, hardware fault, right? So far, four years. Uh, there, there's no uh, RMA yet up to now. Yeah. yeah. So hardware failure is zero. Zero. Very good. Zero. Yeah. It's a good thing because it's a good thing because mm. uh, it saves us a lot. See, uh, when there's always an RMA, we need to to bring it on site and change it. Okay. Hey, it's not good. Uh, with RJ, you just plug it in, you just install it, then just leave it there. And it will do its job. So there's no worry of having RMA uh, so often. Okay. So it helps our company to reduce the cost of transporting and changing the device. And talking about support, okay, uh, I also want to further ask about the operation and uh, support, okay? Because I know uh, uh, CMC far away from your office, right? Around two hour travel time, I, I remember, yes. yeah. So 
I I heard from you. Okay, maybe Ellen, you can also share. Uh, before Yuijie or using uh, our cloud solution, whenever there are some problem, network issues, how your support team do the support? Huh? Huh? I believe uh, very challenging. Huh? You, you can share, Ellen, huh? before. Mm. Okay, the cloud app, the cloud app, Yuijie cloud app is almost enough to support the the whole uh, uh, the ne the whole network because you can see there if there's a problem you can see the fault you can easily see the fault uh, on the cloud app there is a reset button which is really intuitive okay it's really functional there's a reset button wherein you can reset the switch okay sometimes uh the problem is just resetting a switch so in some cases using other brands you need to visit on site and just present it <laughs> uh with real, real J, uh, cloud app you can reset uh, anywhere anywhere so it's a good uh, it's really a good uh, feature mm. also the web cli we can do it remotely. So we have also the Rita. We, we make use of Rita. So mm -hmm. when there's a client call from, uh, from our client, uh, I just, uh, we just tell them to visit Rita for simple problems. So it basically solves a very simple problems. Mm. So when there's an uh, intermediate uh, level problem, we can do, we do the support online. Whenever there is a more complicated problem, we ask the help of the RUJ headquarters, then they quickly, they quickly answer. So it's really a big, big, uh, big help for us. Mm. Because uh, collaboration is uh, is the key for solving solving the problem collaboration. So, okay. Ruji support is really good. Uh, we have not experienced this kind of support with other brands, especially in our case. We uh, our company is not so big, so our company is not so big. So, other brands don't listen to us. See, Ruji, whether you are a small company or a big company. They listen to you. They give you the good support. Mm. Uh, it's really mm. a big help for us. So, so, so let me do some little bit conclude. So before uh, using other brand, okay, other enterprise brand or SMB brand, okay, uh, uh, I can say not much local support or not much technical support on 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 which hope or Ellen, right? Okay, and uh, they didn't have cloud. So every time you need to spend two hours, maybe for very simple uh, problem, just reset a switch or some uh, very simple network uh, uh, configuration changes, right? Every time you need to waste your team, maybe uh, two way round, maybe three hours, at least three to four hours, okay? So, so to you, it's a very expensive, the cost is expensive because your team is not many people, right? Uh, so yes. that you need to for a simple or very uh, 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 simple fault, you need to spend three hours for one engineer. Okay. So for your idea, uh, you also mentioned the remote tools and I, Victor, uh, project sharing, web CRI can, can, can helping you reset or reset switch can helping you do the remote job perfectly, right? Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These functions or this uh, support are very useful, uh, remote support, remote tools. They are very uh, useful on different uh, scenarios. Okay. Uh, may I further know, okay, uh, I know the employees, uh, CMC employee is using PPSK. So uh, I also do know huh, the Wi-Fi also at the same time, we're will, 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 will serving the uh, guests sometime. So how the guests uh, can securely uh, 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 using or visit the, the, the internet, uh, internet Wi-Fi, okay? Uh, and what is the policy uh, you are adopt for CMC for guest Wi-Fi? 
Ah, okay. For guest Wi-Fi, they use the voucher authentication voucher. Ah. with uh, time limit. This is the policy they created. Uh, CMC already created this. I see. For dialysis center, see, they gave four hours. For doctors, they gave unlimited access hmm. with uh, two Mbps hmm. access. And for patients, only three days. I see. With 200 MB data quota. I see. I see. Okay. Yes. Uh, for outpatient, uh, it's only one hour. Yes. Yes. Okay. So maybe before uh, end of the uh, uh, today's uh, um, our uh, uh, open talk for today, uh, any any feedback or. Uh, Statement conclusion, maybe from you and CNC to you, Jay, Alan. Uh, All right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I would say uh, Ruji is a total uh, solution. Uh, it, 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 it doesn't give us so, ma so many challenges in making the configuration. Uh, unlike any other brands, uh, you need to be, you know, technically expert in order to make the configuration. Uh, with with RUJ, you can uh, configure and set up a network in a matter of minutes for simple configuration. But of course, for more complex configuration, uh, you need more time. But I would say, in general, RUJ, uh, RUJ is a total solution. It's a good solution for network. Okay. Thank you, Alan. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Rita. Okay. So, uh, where we uh, look forward, uh, okay, uh, your uh, booming, growing uh, business, okay, uh, okay, and uh, good health, okay. I know Philippines still, <laughs> still some pandemic, okay, spreading, okay. Uh, take care, okay. Take care. Okay, and uh, thank you. Uh, thank bye -bye. you. Okay.